Thanks for sticking with us at 530. I'm Sean Gables and I'm Brittany Miller. Right now, many grocery stores continue to have empty shelves as people buy up whatever they can. That means one industry is working overtime to get them restocked. Yasmina Alston looking at how the trucking industry has remained busy despite everyone else getting laid off. Right now, stores like Publix are adjusting their hours to give their employees time to restock the shelves after coronavirus concerns cleared them. And in the meantime, trucks are working hard to get all of those products to the stores. And there's stores that are empty right now that our truck is responsible of uh, replenishing. It was the rush that started in local grocery stores as coronavirus concerns grew. Stores were packed with people and falling low on certain items. It was that right now everybody's kind of in a panic because of this coronavirus. So everybody's buying up all the waters, everybody's buying up all the toiletry, etc. But guess what? That has to be replenished. So that's what our trucks are responsible for. That's where Alex Burton's drivers step in. The Good Energy Worldwide trucking fleet is part of what he calls the heartbeat of the country, especially right Right now so when the nation is hurting when, when all this stuff is going on we're able to kind of add a little aid to people the drivers working long hours to transport food toiletries and even medicine in a time when some of those items are hard to find Burton says while everything else is shutting down the trucks are still moving this truck will be taking a load of water to Arkansas everybody's dependent on us Everybody's dependent on them. They understand now that the country is in need, so they're going to have to definitely make some sacrifices. And many of these truck drivers are going to be driving for weeks on end to make sure all of those important products get to where they need to go. Reporting in Atlanta, Yasmina Alston, CBS 46 News.